A young Port Coquitlam man is fighting for his life in hospital after he was hit by a big truck early this morning. But the fact he made it to hospital is thanks to two bystanders. The CBC's Tina Lovegreen reports. It happened on this foggy, rain-soaked stretch of Lougheed Highway near Harris Road. It was around 2.30 a.m. when Matt Burnett and Jeremy Scholing were heading home after a night out. I, we just heard a bang, like we need to see what's going on. And Jeremy and I saw somebody lying on the ground and it looked, he looked to be unconscious. Before paramedics arrived, the pair knew they had to do something. I just, I just wanted to see him breathing. That, that was really it. You know, Jeremy was performing CPR and we we're, we're just, we just wanted to make sure that he was alive. A 911 dispatcher talked them through what to do. I think Jeremy was actually able to bring him back and I helped wipe the blood off of his face. I took the shirt off of my back and I don't, I don't even know whose jacket this is, but uh, yeah. Um, the whole experience so overwhelming. Scholing could hardly speak. The victim's blood still on his cheek. I don't know. Intense, I guess. Just some, I don't know. A 22-year-old man from Port Coquitlam was taken to hospital in critical condition. Witnesses say he was trying to hail a taxi and stepped onto the road. He was hit by a five-ton truck. Burnett and Scholing were clearly shaken after the experience, but police are thanking the two for stepping in. We just happened to be there and we did what yeah. we could, right? I, I, I would hope anybody would do the same for me. Tina Lovegreen, CBC News, Vancouver.